is being involved. I think it makes me more well-rounded well um, and I think it just it lets me give back to the community that serves me here at Mizzou. Once I graduate, it doesn't mean I'm done with the university, but there's still going to be people here who benefit from what I did or what I plan to do. Mizzou students are involved in over 400 clubs and organizations. These activities need space to develop and grow. We have so many students on this campus that each have different needs, and all of those organizations have a different purpose for each of those students. It makes us a more diverse campus, and it makes each of our students more involved. In fact, a new student center is so important to Mizzou students, the students voted to increase their fees to support expanding and renovating the current Brady Commons. It was an incredible experience, just getting the word out and getting, you know, making sure students knew about it, letting them know they had a website to go to, giving them all the information. And to see the turnout on election night was truly incredible. And students in over 60% support said that they wanted this building expanded and they really wanted Brady to be a place that was the heart of our university. For a spring referendum, it's unheard of to have that many people. It's still the highest turnout ever, so there's no doubt in our minds. More than 10,000 people pass through Brady each day. But as the students realized, the building just can't meet their growing needs. There's not even enough space to study or eat, besides having adequate meeting rooms or sufficient area for student clubs and organizations. All the student organizations that are in Brady are cramped. They have horrible meeting spaces. Right now, uh, we have little bitty cubicles down in a basement with no windows and no open air and everybody sort of sharing closets and cubicles that have now become offices. When, you know, a freshman really wants to get involved, it's hard to say, you know, come to our meeting and get involved when we don't know where that meeting's going to be more than a week or two ahead of time. The new student center will house Greek leadership, so Mizzou's 5,000 Greek students will have space to plan homecoming programs, philanthropies, and Greek week events. You know, everybody needs that spot where you can go to to know where you can get the information you need, know you can get the resources you need. And I mean, an office being like the staple unit of that, but to have them together in the one spot, you know, you don't, you don't feel like you're getting lost just trying to find, you know, so many different things at one time. You can come to one place and have all those options. It's extremely important because this is the time that we're really creating ourselves and making ourselves and learning. And if we don't have a chance to learn outside the classroom, we're really just getting you know, directly out of a textbook. Uh, the out of classroom experience has added so much for me, whether it's leadership, involvement, just getting to know other people, meeting those connections, figuring out what I want to do for the rest of my life. Three, two. Welcome back to MU Talk. Now we're going to take a Student opinions will be expressed from the center in creative ways by MUTV, KCOU, the student radio station, and the long established student run paper, The Man Eater. All of my closest friends I've met at the Man Eater. It's important for me to see the future staffs have a good place to work and be able to put out a good paper. I also love the KCOU area and MU TV because they're going to really get to expand and do some really neat things in their new studio space. Local food for local people. Mizzou students care about more than just campus facilities and events. They're involved in leadership Thank development. You and opportunities that give back to the community. We go out before the football games, we hand out recycling bags to all tailgaters, and encourage them to recycle. It's a very rewarding uh, uh, group to work with. You can see cha uh, positive changes and tangible things happen, um, like, for example, the recycling program. Last year, over six games, we collected 12.1 tons. That didn't exist the year before last, and um, through efforts of our, all our many volunteers, it, we got a, a great program working on now. But there's also some things, um, some leadership skills that you just have to learn by doing. And it's really, really difficult to just learn those from a book. It's really important to actually be out there um, engaging in tasks on your own and having done that before um, and knowing what it's like, it'll help you out in the future. I kind of jumped in, you know, and maybe a little bit over my head at first. And so I became involved in different things such as MSA and Mizzou Spirit and my sorority and things of that nature. And it really just helped me just kind of realize that, you know, even with 27,000 people, I really can make a difference. We want our Student Center to celebrate campus traditions and everything MU stands for. A special area surrounded by memorabilia from The Shack, a well-loved Mizzou hangout, will offer daily programs including music, open mic comedy and poetry, 
as well as televised sports events. Beetle Bailey, created by Mizzou alumnus Mort Walker, will have a permanent hangout in Mort's. Right now, our student center is in the lower tier of the Big 12, but we're doing everything we can to create a facility that's truly focused on student needs. And this is definitely something that this campus needs, and we really want Brady Commons or the new student center to be a gravitation point for students. We want students to come there, we want students to interact there. Anyone who is, who is visiting this campus, anyone who is a part of this campus will really benefit from the new space, the new areas, and all just the enjoyable activities that will be going on there. What do you remember most about college? The campus? Your friends? All the activities? At Mizzou, our new student center will offer a place for students to make their own college memories. A place to make friends, to study, to relax, to get involved, or to just hang out. Visit our website or talk to a development officer to find out how you can help today's students prepare for tomorrow. I think one thing that amazed me so much was just how supportive everyone has been of the project in terms of students. I mean, students have come out and said, we need this building. For us to advance as an institution, our student center should advance as well. It really is a no-brainer. Um, it's going to provide more space, uh, more effective space, um, and it's going to, like I said before, it's, it's going to be something that's, that creates a headquarters for students to, get, to stay involved on campus. It's time to come back home and find your history in our new student center. Now with over 27,000, almost 28,000 students, Brady Commons is the most heavily used building on the campus. Well, you know, this is a great time to be here on homecoming weekend to have a groundbreaking that is totally focused on students because it is why we're here. And I know that all of us in campus administration and in university administration feel a deep honor to be engaged in this work with the kind of quality students that are here at the University of Missouri. I look forward to coming back someday and telling our future leaders how the MSA President's Office was a converted closet. The new Student Center, through its architecture and design, will forever signify to future students the priority MU places on its students. The ability to make connections, to have a community of support, is absolutely necessary to our successes. The Future Student Center will offer just this sense of community. The new Student Center will house officers from all of our student governments. Nine meeting rooms plus a 120-seat leadership auditorium will allow students to work and meet together in one building. A lot of people have asked me, why are you working so hard for a new Student Center when you won't be around to see it? And my answer is always the same. Nothing will give me greater pride than to come back to Mizzou as an alumnus and to be able to say we, students, work to leave a legacy, a place for students and alumni to call home. Thank you.